Hello and thank you for joining us today on MTD TV. My guest at this time is Simon Yeomans of ITC. We're going to be talking about the M1200 today, are we? Yes, yes, M1200, yes. And what have we got? Well, we've got M1200 in two different sizes here. Uh, we've got the, uh, the larger insert size, both in 80 diameters, and we've got uh, the smaller insert size, again 80 diameter. But the one feature about this particular tool is that we have different styles of bodies which still take the same insert. So we have a 15 degree lead for high feed. We also have a 45 degree for general machining and finishing applications. And we also have a 60 degree body for higher depth of cut. So we can actually suit the face mill for the application or the machine or the material. And we've got that in both sides. Yes, yes. In the smaller insert, we have the same setup of the three different leading angles, yes. So presumably the, the smaller insert, that's for maybe a BT30 or BT40 tapering machine with less power. The larger inserts for your, your high torque spindles or a 50 taper. Absolutely, yes. So yeah, the smaller insert is aimed at the 40 taper machines. The larger insert is for your 50 tapers, deeper depth of cut, bigger feed per tooth and... Uh, the general heavier machining. And I notice obviously being a double-sided insert, they're seated in a, a negative pocket, yep. but we have got quite an aggressive positive insert. So does that mean we can adopt these on, on stainless steels and heat resistant alloys? Yes, they are working well on stainless steels actually. Yeah, they're very good. Uh, we actually uh, did an application not long ago, fantastic results, very, very, very good. So what data could we expect on a, a 316 stainless for instance? 316 stainless, we could, run around about 140 meters a minute with a 45 degree approach uh, using the universal grade, the WU35 grade. Okay, and what other materials categories would be using this, this tool? Well, it covers all the uh, materials more or less. Uh, we've got uh, polished inserts for aluminiums, we've got uh, uh, CVD coated inserts for cast irons, and we've got PVD coated for your steels and up to your nymonics and your Super alloys. So how, these are obviously face mills. What happens if we need to improve a finish? Can we get a wiper insert in these bodies? Yes, the wiper insert is available, but only available in the 45 degree approach. So uh, we got wiper inserts on the diameter 80, we suggest around about one insert. Mm -hmm. If we go larger on diameters, we can put more than one insert, wiper insert in. And just for our viewers at home, can you just tell them what a wiper insert would do? The wiper insert actually sits uh, a little lower of the actual other inserts and that's got a, a, a flat face on it so it's, uh, it actually creates a, a smooth finish and there's only one or two inserts actually creating the finish that you see on the part. So it's actually taken a very limited amount of material off isn't it? Yes, yes. Okay and what are the size ranges available on these bodies? These start at 35 in the smaller insert. We have the uh, cylindrical shank or bore type and we can go up to 160 uh, in this size. And then I bought to around about 315 in this size. Then we can all go, go to a cartridge system, so the wheels are oyster. Yep, and these are all stocked by ITC here in the UK? Yes, yep, next day delivery.